Hi, this is Josh from MYOB Enterprise Solutions. In this video, we're going to look at how to manage invoices in the Accounts Receivable module of MYOB Advanced. If you've watched our videos about the sales process, you'll have seen how you can generate an invoice from a sales order and view it in the Sales Orders module. The Invoices screen in this module shows invoices that came from sales, but invoices in the MYOB Advanced system can also be generated from other sources like contract billing, project billing, or recurring invoices. The Invoices and Memos screen in the Receivables module is where all Accounts Receivable invoices can be managed. It shows all invoices in the system in a standard searchable and filterable grid, and it also lets you enter new ones manually. Before entering an invoice, check the business date at the top of the screen. This is the date that all transactions will be entered as. It defaults to today's date, but if you need to enter an invoice at a different date, you'll need to change the business date before you start. Several invoice types are available for different kinds of transactions, but for a standard invoice we'll keep the default. Select a customer and their default terms will be filled in. Default invoice dates are also filled in based on the business date. You can now enter the line items to be included on the release. When you're done, you can save the invoice. Invoices generated by other modules have the balanced status, which means it's ready to be released. Depending on how your system is configured, newly entered invoices may be on hold to begin with. An invoice needs to be taken off hold before it can be processed further. Once off hold, you can print or email out the invoice in the usual way printing from the Reports drop-down, or emailing from the Actions drop-down. Again, your system configuration can affect the process. Your system may require that invoices be printed and or emailed before they can be released. Once an invoice is ready to be released, this can be done directly from the Invoices and Memos screen by clicking the Release button on the toolbar, or you can release multiple documents at once from the Release AR Documents screen. When you release the document, the system changes its status to open, updates the customer's balance, and generates a general ledger batch with the document transactions. The open status on an invoice indicates to users and the system that the document is pending a customer payment. When the full amount of the invoice has been paid, the system updates the invoice's balance and changes its status to closed, as we'll see when we look at payments. Finally, if you want to see all of the invoices for a particular customer, you can do this on the Customer Details Inquiry screen which shows all invoices and payments for the selected customer, with options to enter new ones. And that's the end of our look at processing invoices in MYOB Advanced. If you want to learn more, visit the MYOB Advanced Education Centre, or see the other videos in our Advanced Academy series for more information on processing sales and receiving payments. Thanks for watching.